It's Chris from AdminJS team here. Uh, it's been a week since I posted the first and original product update, and I want to update to you with the changes that we recently done. So there's one thing I want to tell you about now is actually we extended the way you can the way you can customize the admin JS panel by adding more CSS uh, CSS mark uh, CSS markers and allowing to use the CSS styling all over the panel. Uh, let me quickly show you how it works in the code. And so here I have the simple application, simple admin.js application using Express and, and Prisma. And those are three resources, as you can see, uh, no, other, no other customizations whatsoever. I also prepared a simple CSS file to change the color of the, light, of the sidebar on the left hand, uh, left, left hand side of my application uh, is right here. That's this sidebar over there below the logo. And um, as you can see, the color can be light blue and white. Cool. First thing we have to say is that the custom CSS file is right here in a public, uh, in a public folder. That's the folder where all the static files land in. And I tell my application, uh, I tell my application dot by saying uh, by the line twenty in the line twenty, where I say app dot use uh, public folder as a static uh, as a static uh, provide as a static for providers. So something I'll have to add in here is I'll simply have to tell admin js that my custom CSS files that my custom CSS properties lay in the custom CSS file. And I do that by uh, the, using these three lines in the admin options is uh, I tell them that assets, the, there is a styles, the, there are there is a style file in assets and it's a custom CSS file. Okay, so let's save the work and let's go and let's restart the application. Uh, when I restart the app, Cool, it's right here. And uh, when I restart the app, uh, hopefully when I, yep. Uh, when I refresh the refresh the dashboard, uh, as you can see on the left-hand side, the whole sidebar is now blue and the, the text is white. It's not perfect, I know, but I'm, an, I'm, not, a, I'm not a gray front-end developer, but it works, so you can use it. Uh, we also added and described everything in our documentation. As you can see, there's a new uh, section saying QI customizations, and there's a tutorial on how to override the CSS styles. So go on, take a look at it, use it, and have fun. Uh, have fun working on your dashboards, and see you then. Bye.